Nebraska town to dead Becky Hoff he had always been told her little town of Pilger, Nebraska would never see a tornado too close to the Elkhorn River. The folklore went. Instead Pilger got to at the same time. The rare twin tornadoes that spun through on Monday night wiped out the town's business district obliterated its fire station and ground 40 or 50 homes into rubble Stanton County Sheriff Mike Hunger said. As much as three-fourths of the town of 350 is gone, Hunger said. Two people died during the storm one the five-year-old the second death the traffic accident was probably weather-related, Younger said. Faith Regional Health Services in Norfolk said 16 people were critically injured in the storms. In southern Wisconsin a line of thunderstorms that spawned twisters rolled through late Monday and early Tuesday. The town of Madison was hit hard. Mayor Paul Sotland said about 25 homes were damaged by the storm which caused about $10 million in damages reported CNN affiliate WKOW. The National Weather Service said it appeared a tornado touched down and lifted several times in the Mineral Point and Verona areas. At least 19 homes in Verona, near Madison were damaged so badly they were uninhabitable WKOW reported. The weather service said two tornadoes touched down in Plateville. No deaths were reported. In Nebraska, severe weather also caused damage in the towns of Wisner, Stanton and Pender. All four communities are within about 40 of one another about an hour and a half northwest of Omaha. See damage from Nebraska tornadoes The National Weather Service also received unconfirmed tornado reports from Iowa, North Dakota and in Wisconsin, where emergency workers were searching homes in Madison and Verona after possible wine damage there according to police. There were no reports of injuries or deaths, authorities said. The risk of severe weather will linger into Tuesday. Portions of 17 states from Montana to Massachusetts were at slight risk of severe storms Tuesday including the possibility of a few tornadoes the National Weather Service's Storm Prediction Center said. No watches or warnings were in effect Tuesday afternoon. Back in Pilger storm chasers captured dramatic video of the twin tornadoes teetering through the countryside. At one point the twisters straddled the state highway 